guys good? So why did you want to get here again and check it out? Spend 48 hours in Tallahassee? Uh, I mean, they've been on me since, I mean, since summer, I mean, since spring started, they wanted me to get up here, uh, check everything out. I uh, wish I could get to like a spring practice, we get to a spring game, but I mean, I had to get to see practice, I mean, practice went well, so. Did you watch them work out this morning? Um, not any. No. What all did you get to do in your time here over the last two days? Uh, spent time with Coach uh, Dugans, Coach Atkins, and Coach Mike Novell uh, with the OC Academics. Uh, means I'm a major in when I get here. Um, yeah, that's really it. I'm talking with Coach Dugans. What in particular stood out in those conversations? What is kind of the thing he's telling you about why FSC wants you in their offense? Uh, really just because I'm a, I'm a – uh, I'm a guy that they see I can come in and change the program around uh, with Coach Dugan. He see like some of the stuff we do at my high school, we do here, they do out here at Florida State. So that would be e an easy transition for me. Um, and with Coach Atkins, really just Coach Atkins, I see he's a real coach. He didn't sure coach anything with me in that meeting. And we talked a lot of ball too. But you know, mostly outside of football, we talked about a lot of real in, like, in real life stuff. Um, just he touched me a, a lot with that with the uh, little meeting we had with each other. What's your relationship with Mike Norvell like? Uh, it's really me and him got a great uh, relationship. Uh, he just since my freshman year, he just been telling me the person I'm gonna be in, the type of recruit I'm gonna be in this, and it, it definitely uh, planned that he's seen it before it really happened, and I can't thank him enough for that. And he's definitely a, one of the realest coaches in uh, college football to me for sure. Yeah, how how do you feel about um, what's next for you on the I mean, what's next for you on the recruiting trail? Uh, what's, and, and where's Florida State stacking up now that you had this visit? Uh, Florida State, I can say first they actually uh, this visit actually set the ball hard. Uh, Florida State, I'm gonna definitely really give Florida State a real look now. Uh, I had to get back to the game. I probably I want to get back to when they play Miami. This visit really set the ball high, I can say for sure. Yeah, will the, will the Miami visit be an official visit, unofficial visit? Have you decided official. that yet? Not yet, but I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna take it official. Okay. official. What What do you want to see when you make that return visit? What is it that you still need to learn about this place? Uh, just want to see the offense. That's really it. But I feel like it definitely it definitely going to be better than last year. I mean, they look great last year, but I feel like this year. Is, it definitely go set the ball hard this year. You've consistently in your recruitment taking visits, but you've also said I'm very firm to Ohio State. Why the decision to take those visits despite being firm to uh, guys? Build, build relationship with coaches because you never know you, you might need them one day. Uh, that's the reason why I'm still taking visits. Uh, things happen in college football every day with coaches getting new uh, jobs, head coaching jobs, changing and stuff like that. So I just want to make sure I'm ready for when that day's happening. If I get there too, uh, one of the coaches leave or both of them leave, and I just want to be prepared. Yep.